Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm lucky from Textile Studio. So in today's tutorial we will teaching you how to design this amazing party flyer using Adobe Photoshop. So without wasting much time, let's get started. For this tutorial, I'll be using 2000 by 2300 pixels. Then, uh, we are going to hit create. So the first thing we need to do is to create our background. Hit gradient. And um, let's change the color to something else. You can pick the color code and uh, practice along with me. Make sure the foreground is set to black, okay? Then change the blend option to screen. Sorry, overlay. Okay. So bring in this cloud image here. I change it to soft light.
I'll bring you this image, scale it up a little. Change the blending option to screen. And let's take up some SS part. So bring your model image. And go back to layers. Press yes. And hit the move background. And when the magic happen. Use the cover adjustment to uh, make the image dark a little. Okay. Hit this icon here to clip it to the model image alone. Alright. Press Ctrl G to do. Let's change this text to reverse might. Scare this up a little. So when you're done, you when you're done, you, you press Ctrl S. Okay. So on this layer, you press Control or Shift and E. Right. So 
drag the uppermost layer down to this our design. I think it above this dark. This dark I want for dark shade or Change this to arc and um, let's reduce the bend into 10 or 15. Uh, okay, 12, 12 is okay. So let's start typing our text. For this text, I use um, the Hammer Boutique. Alright, so this is the color code I use. You can find everything in the description below. Alright, I made everything so easy for you guys. So, um, always save your job whenever you, you, you are working, alright? Always make sure you save your job to avoid losing your job. Don't forget that. Alright, always, always have it at the back of your mind and whenever you decide to save your job, alright? Let's start typing our text.
please if you enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to give the subscribe button if you are not yet a subscriber and um if you're a subscriber or i don't know just make sure you give it the like all right so we're almost done okay Uh, press Ctrl, Alt, Shift, and E. Alright, now let's go over to Camera Raw effect. So let's increase the contrast a little. Um, we use the shadows and increase the clarity. So come to this effect, very the grain. Alright? So we are done if it's okay. So here comes the end of this tutorial. I really hope you got something from this. So um, if you're not yet a subscriber, don't forget to subscribe and also like this video, share to your friends, alright? and um also comment please just tell me what you want to improve in my video okay also um tell me what you want me to upload next all right because uh, i want to serve you guys better at least because you are doing a great job with my channel so i'll see you guys in my next video bye for now